Good day. I read this article in the New York Times by Patrick Kingsley. It was about Hungary. There's an election coming up in Hungary in April. And of course, Mr. Orban will win. Hungary is one of the few democracies left on this planet and it's actually working where the government is listening to the citizens. So this article is the nastiest thing I've read in a long time. It's also extremely stupid. So this is what I think. They think they have lost Hungary. The guys in Brussels, they realize it. They have lost Hungary. There's no way they're going to get them back into the arms of globalism. And of course Soros and the others, they realize this. So this is what they would do. You know, they complain about it, they nag about it. So this article portrays Mr. Orban as, first of all, a populist, of course. There's no way that citizens will vote for this guy unless he's a populist, according to these guys. And they want to portray him as a dictator. And, they, and this article is doing this in a very slimy sort of way, nasty stuff. Yeah. And this guy will never, he will never understand what democracy is about. Never. If these guys vote for Mr. Orban, there's something wrong with them. That's what he thinks. And he thinks you can blame the media for it. The media hasn't been aggressive enough. If media was more aggressive, the citizens of Hungary will suddenly realize that they are voting for a populist dictator. It's amazing to watch this. I hope that Mr. Orban wins this election by a landslide. Uh, that would be very nice. And I think he will. Because he's one of the best politicians we have in Europe. He's a great guy. So, um, yeah, that's it. Bye.